40 days there, but he's promised to go back and uh, spend a bit more time and learn a few words and even the national anthem. He might have to sing it in Sydney if he can keep the progress going. So that's the question of the Bulgarians. Hopefully that explains it. We've talked a little bit about the grip and the tape, I think, so hopefully you've... Uh, had a better understanding of these bars that they're using here and the tape that you see on their hands. Meanwhile, this is now a very important lift for Kakashvili's 225. Second attempt. He's got four lifts out of four so far. This for four, 12 and a half total. Two and a half below the standard. Sorry, five below the standard. That's better. Yes, that was so much more efficient. Yeah, that was just a completely different lift. Technically, absolutely perfect. He wasted not an ounce of energy in doing that. And it's looking pretty good to me because he goes four, 12 and a half. He's 10 kilos ahead of the field. Kalechki's got two lifts to go. Kakashvili's still got one reply. Now, what would you do if you were Kakashvili's? Let, let, let Kalechki get in there and keep the one lift up your sleeve, wouldn't you? Um, because what's Kalechki's going to come for 225. That still leaves him seven and a half kilos behind. Effectively 10 because he's heavier. So he's matching pace. Or perhaps what he's doing is deciding that 